Welcome to the Sunday Shave of the Day. Hey, Eric here with Adventures in Wet Shaving, and welcome back. It's good to see you. If this is your first time here and you're interested in learning how to straight razor shave, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Then click on the bell next to it to be notified when I upload videos. That way you won't miss a thing. Now, in tonight's shave, I'm using my Gold Dollar 66. This is just a wonderful shaver. Yeah, not expensive, probably half hollow, and uh, does the job. Works fine. All right, and for our soap tonight, Sterling Soap Company, and this is Coconut Lime. This is just marvelous. Coconut Lime, I'm in for a lime shave. Yep. Now, I've had that puck bloomy, and here's my brush. This is the Omega 10,098, and we'll just go ahead and get that bloom water out, and I'm going to put that on as free shave. Yep. All right. So, how you doing? Hopefully, you're, you had a good week. We made it to the weekend. Oh yeah, nice. And maybe on this weekend you're having some downtime, you know, time with your family and friends, which is brilliant. You know, that, you can't underestimate downtime. That is so good. And hopefully the world has been treating you good and you're in good spirits, yep. There we go. Get most of that water out of that brush. All right. Now, now we're talking. Okay. Yep. And hopefully you're having some good shaves, right? Yeah. I'll tell you what, I've been having some good shaves. Now, as you can see, this is a few days growth. But other than that, you know, in this straight razor, Take care of that, no problem. There will not be a problem with that at all. When you have a straight razor, you know, there's no clogging up, right? So that's good. Yep. All right, nice, nice. There we go. Now I got soap everywhere, of course. So I'm gonna put some of that on the brush. Take the rest of that. And if I can, because I did, I made a mess this time. It's all right, though. That's what it's about, making messes. We're making a big mess to get clean. Yep. All right. Now, look at that. Woohoo. Nice. All right. And... That is going to do it. The trick. We're going to get our lather on here. Yep. Mm-hmm. Nice. And I really wanted to appreciate you guys uh, for subscribing. You know, thank you so much. And thanks for uh, all the good comments really really enjoy it you know this is how we can interact together and it is wonderful it really is and I've met so many nice people it's so good really all right, now this is pass one, which is primarily against the grain, so let's get going.
Yeah, nice. All right, look at that. Excellent. Excellent, excellent. Now we get that soap off of there. Clean that razor up. And we'll be in business. Now, keep in mind, I do Shave of the Day videos every, two, every Wednesday. Sorry about that. Every Wednesday and Sunday. So go ahead and uh, two times a week. And tune in, and you can share a shake with me. Nice, nice, and that's just cutting right through it. Several days growth, um, not sure how many, but uh, quite a few. Okay, nice. Really good. Sterling Soap Company makes a performer. Really does. Nice tallow-based soap. If you like tallow soap, this could be very well be for you.
Nice, there you go. Pass one complete. Now, let's get that washed off, see how we did. Yeah, nice, nice beard reduction. That's what we're shooting for. You know, with straight razor shaving, you don't get that shave the first, out of the gate the first time with that first pass. You're just reducing beard every time. And in doing so, you get a tremendously good shave and it lasts, lasts longer for me anyway, than doing the shaving in other ways. I just feel like it's better, yeah. And I also do uh, Friday Straight Razor Edge Friday Specials. All right, hopefully you enjoyed last Friday. Um, that is uh, what I do here for the Friday Specials is I try to answer questions and demonstrate how to do what to do and in hopefully in a helpful way yeah so there you go now that was a beginner shave for uh, teenagers and newbies so you click right up here and you can see that I'll go ahead and link that up there for you and then that way uh, you'll know what I'm talking about all right and if that's you that hope that will be helpful I think as well as in the description I've got links to a whole lot of helpful uh, videos and playlists for you there as well too all right, so this is going to be against the grain on my neck here. Right here is going to be, uh, actually that's against the grain. This is across the grain. <laughs> this is also going to be against the grain. So let's get going. Okay, there's that, get that blade cleaned off. Nice. Really good. Really, this is a fine razor for uh, the price, and you can put an edge on it. Not a problem.
There we go. Nice. I may have actually hit a little bump on that one. A lot of times when I let my beard grow out this much, that does happen. You know, your face gets used to that razor, and uh, then when you don't do it for a few days, then sometimes it uh, takes a day or two to get back into it. Nice. Yeah. Looking good. Looking good. Okay. Nice. Okay. There we go. All right, pass two complete. Now, let's get that washed off, see how we did. Yeah, nice. Very nice. Okay. And when you re-wet your face with that soap, it's so slick. The residual slickness on that is just off the scales with this. So good. There we go. Nice. 
get that dried off and now this is primarily going to be against the grain okay so let's do it Oh yeah, nice. Really good. There we go. Yeah, I have found that that chin could use just a little bit more work. So we'll just go ahead and throw that back in again. It is not that much work anyway. So that's another shave in the books right there. Let's see how we did. All right. Yeah. I hope you guys are getting as good a shaves as I am. I really do. Really, that is, that would be the best. Yep. Okay, alum everywhere. Okay, and now we're going to dry that off. Nice. All right, and there's lemon witch hazel. So this is lemonade for the face. So I had coconut lime soap. Now I've got lemon, so we're doing a lemon lime. Oh, yeah. Nice. Okay, and we're just going to put that everywhere. I like it, and it's good for you, really is, works wonders. All right, next, okay, for a cologne kind of thing, Fine Snake Bite, check that out. Is that a great label or what? Yeah, now this is pretty much straight up menthol and alcohol. So that is what you're gonna get from this. So 
For me, that means it can go with about anything. Yep. Oh yeah. There you go. And that menthol is just brilliant. Really is. Now we're gonna finish the shave off with the Nivea Poche Balm. Excellent. You know, repair the face, rehydrate, good stuff. All right, hey, thank you so much for being here for this shave, really appreciate you. Click right up here to see a full shave from pre-shave to post-shave, all the routine, all right? And again, thank you for subscribing, really appreciate you. Click right over here to see my latest video. Click down here on the video especially picked out for you. Click over here on me, subscribe, like, comment, share this video with your friends. Have a great shave and a good day. And I will see you next time on Adventures in Wet Shaving.